The following is a presentation of Apostle L.D. Wilkerson Ministries. Welcome to the first edition of Apostolic Oil. I'm Apostle L.D. Wilkerson, founder and general overseer of Seal Covenant Ministries International. You know, each week I desire to reach out to those of you who may be hurting, experiencing various difficulties, or just need an encouraging word for the day. Oftentimes we in ministry just need someone who understands where we are and will just keep it real. Now, I don't know about you, but that was certainly my case. I just needed someone that I could relate to, someone that could understand, someone that I could share my heart, even my frustrations with. So, I decided to give you what I didn't get until late in my ministerial life, a friend. Each week, I will share some apostolic oil with you, my friends, here on Facebook. And so today, tonight, as you ponder, some of you will be up late tonight, I want you to think about some things and look at the life of the dreamer, Joseph, in Genesis chapter 37. Looking back upon the story of Joseph the dreamer and seeing how God exalted him in the land of Egypt and blessed him with favor and great success, a pattern emerges, providing us today with guidelines that we may follow into our own place of honor. And so today I'll give you lesson one from that life of Joseph. I want you to receive God's promises with childlike faith. You see, though Joseph showed immaturity in how he told his brothers about his dreams, he nevertheless demonstrated a most commendable childlikeness in how he received the dreams from God. He didn't question them. He didn't debate them like we do. Um, he took them as truth and believed them without doubt. Many of our difficulties come when we complicate the things of God with our own thoughts, ideas, opinions, and views. Or perhaps we just dismiss the great things that God has in store for us by listening to the voices that accuse us of being vain and ambitious. Though God would make us great, we belittle ourselves when we side and, and get with that which is not the truth. The first lesson here for all dreamers is that you must receive God's promises with childlike faith. So tonight, go to bed, sleep well, dream large, and wake up in the morning like a kid again. God bless you and keep you is my prayer.